honestly the prettiest dress I've ever seen in my life. See if I'm honest, I don't even know what 851 is. I just know it's talking about aliens. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. I just want to quickly say thank you so much for all the support everybody gave me for my last video. It really meant a lot. But today's a wee bit different and I'm going to be doing a lockdown haul because I've been shopping like crazy in the last um, three months or four months I've been in lockdown and I've got a bunch of things from ASOS, Nike, um, H&M, PLT, Misguided so hope you do enjoy it and let's just jump right in. First dress what is this yellow ASOS design I think that's the like the brand called it's like the own ASOS one and um, I got it in size 6 and it's quite like baggy because it's like it's maybe like a suede dress I think but it is like kind of unflattening I paired a belt with it um, to kind of cinch it in a wee bit so that's um, how I've paired that and a wee bit of a pair of boots maybe <laughs> one I got is this um, long kind of maxi dress and this is from Motel Rock, Motel Rocks I think that's their name. It's like a zebra print and I paired this under a black top. Um, I did try a white one but the ones that I've got are too like, they've got writing too far up and like the neck's quite funny. So I did the black one and then I put a belt around it again with um, some combat boots as well. The next one is kind of like one of these um, pur purchases I was like wanted to buy for a while and it was like out of stock and then I got like a notification saying it was back in stock and I was like you know what I'm just gonna buy it it's a sticky and white jumper and I know it's kind of like funny weather it's summer so I really shouldn't be buying jumpers but at the same time I live in Scotland so it's still kind of baddish weather it's just great it's a sticky and white on it and it's like funny it's like felt it's quite cool yeah I'll put the prices around if I've not said that yet so the other things I got were these top shop um like cotton like runner shorts and um, because when it is really nice in Scotland I don't really have like lounge about shorts like for the garden and stuff so I put, picked these up and they're really comfy the next one is a really random buy for me because I tend to like stick to like what I'm comfortable in and um, so I bought these jeans from ASOS and for my height and my like petiteness and whatever I find it really hard to find like good fitting jeans or like joggies or leggings whatever because I am like small and petite so it's like hard to like get a good length and whatever. Um, so these are the ASOS denim. They're in the colour rust but it's like an orangey kind of colour. Um, so like straight leg type of mom jean type of fit. Um, but what I like to do is just roll up the bottoms. I've not actually wore these yet but like expose like expose cut like I don't even know if that's a thing but yeah and I just tend to roll them because I've got Zara jeans that are quite similar um, and I roll the bottoms of them and I really like the look of that. I got a pair of heels and that is really random. For my birthday I got a gift voucher for ASOS with my friends. I got like, I was needing a pair of black heels like because mine are like pure a mess. So I thought I'd treat myself to a good pair of black heels. So I got these from Zimmy London. Zimmy London? I don't actually know how to say that. Never actually like bought shoes from ASOS or that brand I feel like it'd be dead hard to like to do up especially if you're not completely sober and I cannot wait to wear them even though they probably will hurt they're black lace up but at the toe in the like heel part it's like uh, clear and I really like that because they're quite unique I guess and obviously like I've not worn heels like in my house so can't wait to actually go out and get done up like I'm so excited um, I also picked up two pairs of earrings for them, so I got these little ASOS dragon ones. But the only thing is, like, I thought they were going to be so much bigger. I don't mind them though, and they'd be cute. I've worn them in my second hauls, um, that I really like. I also picked up these cute little dainty stars as well, but my only issue is the backing is absolutely ginormous. Like, I honestly do not know why they've, they've made like studs, but like the backing's longer than the actual earring. Because like, Maybe it's just my ears because they're quite funny but like when I got them obviously I tried them in and like you can see the full back. I don't know if I could like cut them to make them not as long or like bend them like behind but then that looks a bit funny from the side so I don't actually know but they're really cute and dainty. I mentioned that I got this ring and um, this like, ring right here from ASOS that I really like and normally because my, my fingers are obviously quite skinny um, and small rings don't really fit me unless they're like size like not just small medium. Um, but I managed to 
find out that this is quite similar sizing to Pandora and it worked out perfectly fit good. Um, I so just realised I bought this phone case while well, I was taking a like outfit show. Um, I got this from ASOS as well, £5. So if you have the same iPhone as me, I think it's like the 6, 7 and 8 if it's £5 and it's such good quality. It's like pressed flowers, so pretty. So I'm going to move on to H&M, a cute wee dress because I don't actually have a lot of these wee dresses. I've got this wee pink kind of flowery one and um, it's got this wee like bit. I don't actually, I don't know what this is called but it's got that there, it's really stretchy. The only thing is like I don't know if I'm like lopsided like my shoulders or maybe I've just got bad posture but straps always fall down and it's pure annoying like it's not really I guess it's not really super elastic I'd rather it tighter so then it didn't fall um, but yeah it's really cute then I, I jumped on a train because I don't actually know why because it doesn't suit me but I did cardigan that ties just in the middle here Um, I've got a size got a size extra small and I probably shouldn't because it's a little bit too tight like it's fine but like for that like trendy look that's going on right now like just to wear this as a top it doesn't look as nice but saying that I would probably wear it as the trend because I'm not that confident <laughs> Um, I have worn it with like a bralette underneath and it looks kind of alright Um, it's nice just to have a white cardigan though for like summer I also picked up this like white bodysuit that's got the buttons down the middle Um, just really basic and yeah Okay, we're gonna go on to PLT and <laughs> I don't know why I got excited there, but um, I got this ribbed. It's kind of like a battleship grey um, racer back top. That's um, very casual, but I like it. Like, and then I got this really cool Area Fifty One top. And see, if I'm honest, I don't even know what Area Fifty One is. I just know something about aliens. But um, it looks like this. It says Area Fifty One. Caution. Now it's got a wee green alien on it, pointing at you, so that's cool. It's quite a size small, and I'm normally like an extra small whatever in tops, but my plan was to make it kind of oversized and then a kaya and stuff like that, make it a little bit cooler. <laughs> and then I got these really comfy joggies that I've been living in like the full lockdown. So just like classic ones, but they're a little bit too long for me. Well, they're not too long with me, but like if I want to wear shoes and like a wee bit ankle showing, I need to roll it. But yeah. Me is, is like the stitching down the middle and it doesn't have pockets but I can see by that because I they do fit me kind of right and they were cheap I think if I can recall I'm going to move on to honestly the prettiest dress I've ever seen in my life and if any of you have watched Patricia Bright you would have seen this in her haul that she made I like that see when I saw this dress I was like oh my god I actually need that it's the prettiest thing ever I don't know if it's just because Patricia was made in it and it made me feel like that was a pretty dress in the world because she is actually gorgeous but what do you see this? So I'm going to show you a wee clip of me wearing this and obviously I probably won't do it justice because this dress is so pretty like I can't go over how good Patricia looked in it. To be fair as this it doesn't look very nice but on it makes your figure look so nice and on. Oh I cannot wait to wear it out but it'll probably be like actually next year I can wear it. Um, love it it's like that word again I don't know like route ruffled I, I don't know what I've taught that I'll put it somewhere if I can remember and it's like mesh and it honestly just hugs your figure and it's so nice and it like seems good quality as well like only thing is this ring I've got like the, the Pandora like ring catches on a lot so I'm like if this catches then it'll actual bloody rip <laughs> the last bit I'm gonna show you is, is from Nike we have a Nike outlet beside me and they just opened up and they did like sales so I spent, I spent a little bit <laughs> and I got these shoes do you know I've, act, I've actually been in there looking for shoes because I've been going on a lot of walks and stuff like that and like I, I've been wearing my work shoes I don't actually know what they're called Nike Air Max Sequin 4GS I don't know what that means but yeah I'll boot what they were meant to be and what them, I got them for because everyone loves a bargain like I love looking at stuff like that um, they're really comfy on, I've already worn them, I've worn them a few times and they're really comfy and I just overall like the shoe, like it's just pretty. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot I actually bought this. This was like just before I was walking to the like counter, whatever. Just when I was walking there, 
I saw this jacket and my sister was actually looking for a jacket but I really liked it. I was like, we'll just share so we're sharing it. It's just like the Nike puffer jacket but it's size small and that's the only one I saw was there so I was like, I'll just grab it. Kind of forgetting it's the men's so it's a little teeny little bit big but for like the winter and stuff I think it'll be good because then like go to uni or whatever I can be a little bit cosier and I'll obviously wear like jumpers underneath it and stuff like that. Um, the next thing I got from Nike is just this classic Nike like jumper like zipper I've been looking for like a black zipper because I um yeah it's not the bold enough <laughs> because I'm so like petite and stuff like that I can fit any like kid stuff and do you know what I'm not embarrassed to say that because I, that's a good thing because I have saved so much money on kid shoes and stuff like that I've saved so much on like wearing actual children's clothes like from Zara and stuff like that and they also have different styles whatever but I picked up this um, like half zip from the kids section I got it in a large um, just because I like the colour of it and the other ones that I saw in like the adults only had grey which I picked up as well but yeah it's really cool and comfortable I picked up a, just a plain white Nike top with just like the logo on it very comfy and it's like one of these long ones so I can tie it um, I got it in a size extra small and it's still like a pretty good size for me to like you know tie it um, to make it kind of shorter if I'm in joggies or whatever but fine for like leggings if I'm going to the gym or whatever when they open these are the little kids boys and they fit me like fine but they're too like baggy at the ankles like they're too like straight leg so I'm going to return them when like the queue is not as bad um, but they are really comfy and I was kind of like debating to keep them or not I'm like you know what I'll feel much better getting that like what 12 pound back or something just because I know I won't tend to wear them as much as I would if they fit me do you know what I mean so you got them and I also picked up a pair of those like socks they're in my drawer like I'm not showing you because they're just socks do you know what I mean but I also got this grey Nike half set this is from this is from the women's not the men's or the adults <laughs> but this is just a really comfy so you got that I spent £144 in Nike. Like, I actually thought I was going for like one thing at like £20 or something, but <laughs> you'll know if I Yeah, that is my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm sorry the lighting's really bad. I was, it was a horrible day outside, if I'm honest. If you did like this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. Um, give me a wee subscribe if you want. I'm actually lying to you, it's like, this is not only the stuff I've bought, I've bought so much more but I feel like the clothing and like the wee bits of jewellery I've picked up are like the fun parts. So yeah I'll see you all in the next video hopefully. Bye!